Hola, Super Estrellas. Welcome back to one of my autograph videos where I doodle a player and bug them through the mail for an autograph. With election day yesterday, I figured it appropriate that I draw a former Washington senator. Oh, <laughs> I'm hilarious. Uh, anyway, today I'm drawing one of my favorite names in all of baseball, Camilo Pascual. Born in Cuba, 86-year-old Camilo Pascual was one bad hombre. He pitched for 18 years, he was a seven-time All-Star, and with his devastating curveball, he led the league in strikeouts for three consecutive years from 1961 to 1963. He's a member of the Cuban Baseball Hall of Fame and the Minnesota Twins Hall of Fame. After baseball, he served as a pitching coach and then a scout where he scouted such players as Alex Cora, Omar Dahl, Miguel Cairo, and Jose Canseco. And not only does he have a super fun name, he's also got a great nickname, Little Potato. It's no wonder I was never a major league pitcher, or even good at baseball for that matter. My parents did not have the foresight to name me Camilo Pascual. They named me after a 1970s Mac Davis pop song that no one remembers. Thanks a lot, Mom and Dad. Nor did I ever have an awesome nickname. My nickname was Nub, for no other reason than one of my co-workers didn't feel like calling me Scott. But... Camilo Pascual is a name that could have been in the Magnificent Seven, maybe along with Yul Brenner and Steve McQueen, or maybe Gunfight at the OK Corral with Burt Lancaster and Kirk Douglas. Camilo Pascual is a name that makes Tony Montana sound like a silly Billy Nancy boy. Camilo Pascual is a name that instilled fear into opposing batters and earned the respect of Ted Williams. And Little Potato, man, how awesome is that nickname? Like, it doesn't seem scary or particularly intimidating, but imagine telling someone, they call me Little Potato, and that person would be like, why? And you just sneer at them and throw some french fries in their face and say, you don't need to know, and then walk away triumphant. I have completely gone off the rails again, my apologies. Let's see, I'm looking for something else to talk about, but somehow my browser ended up on the Scarface Wikipedia page, so I'm gonna stop here. There's our doodle, I've got a super cool 1960 Topps All-Star card, there's my note and a little cash donation, and we are off to the mailbox. Let's see what we got. Ooh, this card looks awesome. Gorgeous signature. Oh, all right, he answered some questions too. His favorite player he scouted was Kinseiko and Burt Lancaster would play him in Little Potato, the Camilo Pascual story. And look at that, he signed the doodle too, personalized it, so I'm keeping this one. I love it, fantastic return. Thank you, Mr. Pascual, and thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, yada, 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 and we'll see you hombres next time. Adios muchachos.